In this video, we will see the different application modes to create web I document and analyze data. In SAP web I report, you have three different application modes to create web I document and analyze data. The data reading and design. When a web I document is opened, you can see different application modes at the top right corner. Data mode to create new data provider, change existing data sources, etc. Reading mode to display existing reports, search text and monitor changes in the report and the design mode. This mode is used to design the web I report. You can add, delete objects in report and apply conditional formatting. Let us go to SAP BO system and see the different application modes in a web I document. Let's see how we can check the different application modes in the SAP web intelligence report. So I have already opened any report existing report and here we will see how many application modes we have and what is the difference between them. So we have three different application modes that can be used to build the queries, create the documents, to analyze the reports. So these are the three different application modes that is your reading mode, your design mode and the data mode. So in the data mode, we can create the new data providers, we can change the existing data sources or we can rename the data provider. So let's say if I click on this data. So here you can see that it is showing me which all data sources are used to create this report. After that, what is the name of the data source? What is the refresh date? Then what is the duration of it? Then what is the status and how much data we are getting from each one of them. So we can see that these many rows we are getting from the query 1 and these rows we are getting from the query 2. So in the data mode, it shows the list of all the available data providers and all the options in the tool mode are disabled in this mode. So you can see here that all these options are disabled right now. So if you are in the data mode, you will be able to only see the options which are to manage your data providers. After that, we have the option of reading mode. So my reading mode will allow you to display the existing reports. So let's say if I go to the reading mode here, it will allow you to see the existing report, search the text, monitor the changes in the reports and drill down on the data in the report. So you can use the left panel and the toolbar in the reading mode. So you can see here that this is my left panel and then we have the uh, reading mode. So all these options you can see in the reading mode. Then we have the design mode. So let's say if I go to the design mode. So design mode is mainly for the developers. So this mode will allow you to add, delete objects in the report, apply the conditional formatting, apply the formulas, create variables. So everything which is required for the developer, all these things will be enabled in the design mode. So you can see here that all the top menus which were disabled in the data mode, they are now enabled because the design mode is for the developers and the developers will be developing the reports using in this mode. So in the design mode with data, so we have two options under it. If we go to this drop down next to the design, we have two options design with data and design with structure only. So in the design mode with data, all the modifications will be applied. Let's say if I go to the design with data. So in the design with data, all the modifications applied in the report are on the server. In case you have to make a lot of changes in the existing report, it is always recommended to use the structure mode because it will take lot of time otherwise as let's say if you have lot of records in your report. So if you do the changes in the design with data, all the changes will be applied to the all the records of the report. Now let's say if I go to the structure mode. So my structure mode will only show me the definition of my report, like what columns it is using, what is the formatting of it. So in this mode, you will not be able to see the data. Rather, you will be able to see the definition mode. So this mode is very useful for the performance point of view. So if you have to design the report, so you can use this report, uh, you can use this structure mode 
and you can design your report and once you are done with all your designing you can show the data by using the design with data option so this way it will save your lot of time so in this tutorial we have seen what are the different application modes in your web intelligence document thank you